Hey everyone, I'm Dina, and I use the Coastal Scents Original Palette to create this look, and I hope you enjoy. Thanks a bunch. Okay, the first thing I did was I applied the Scandalous Eyeshadow Base all over my lid, up to the brow bone. And a little goes a long way. Next, I'll be taking this light color here and applying it into and I'm applying it to the inner corner of the eye using my 219 and I'll also be applying some of it up here on the brow bone as a highlight and you can bring it down and get in here just a little bit blend into this part here and it'll lighten up the eye okay next I'll be taking this color here and I will be applying just the next color and pat it in so you don't get as much fallout. You can bring it up just a little past the crease. Okay, and then also be doing some of that under the eye just slightly. Okay, don't worry about the fallout, we'll clean that up later. Okay, wipe off your brush a little bit. The next color we'll be taking this one here. And applying that as the next color. And blend. Okay. Also take that and put it under the eye. And blend it a little bit. Try to stay right in the center of your eye where that line blends in right down the center of your eye okay the next color we'll be taking is this color here okay. and we'll be adding that right in here and then carrying it up in here just a little bit we'll come back over is just to kind of give it a guide where to go and then we'll be carrying it down into here okay. Okay. and then we'll be taking this color here okay. we're going to just swipe it just a little bit above the purple, just to let it a little peak the purple above the purple and a little bit of pink peak of the pink and just kind of blend it a little bit kind of bring it in a little bit not too far okay. and pick up the purple again and Okay. and then just start to blend in a little bit and don't worry if we lose some of the color we'll pick up more with that blue okay. don't worry about any of that either any of that and even there we'll wipe it up so that's so far what it looks like we'll get some more of that blue and blend a little bit more this blue here okay. and Again, you could use a little bit of black if you want, like this color right here, to define the crease a little bit more. Okay, wipe off your brush and a little bit more blending. And then I'll take some of the purple that we had earlier, this color again. And go over top of that so you don't lose that color. Okay, like that. Okay. 
Then you want to take your, your 217. And you can use the set or the regular. I have both, but I like the little brush. Blend up a little bit. Sorry, I got it cut off. But basically, I took a wipey and I wiped off the excess to create a nice little cat eye point. And that's about it.